Hey guys, Ed Wyman here. So the lifeblood of our digital agencies is our clients and helping our clients get a great return on investment. The reality is you're not always guaranteed to keep a client. Am I allowed to say that? Of course, it's the truth. We all know it, but nobody wants to mention it. Um, I can I can charge a client $1,000 a month, get them a great return on their investment and um, they could still let me go. And the reason why, their cousin could come in at half price and offer them a deal. The business gets sold and the new owner wants to hire a local company. You know, th things happen, guys. And um, you always want to put yourself in a situation where you're always prospecting. You have you have fresh opportunities with fresh business owners who are qualified, looking to grow their business. And that's what I wanted to share with you briefly. So the truth is this. Most people are overcomplicating their prospecting. Um, you're saying too much. You're burning yourself out by by doing these audits, these these in-depth presentations to try to impress people, I'm here to tell you you're wasting your time. And I know because I've done those things and I thought, oh, if I do a 10 minute audit of their website and show them all the stuff that they can improve, they'll be impressed. And sometimes it happens, but the vast majority of the time it's a waste. So I'm gonna propose a very simple, very different way of prospecting. It is using Facebook. Um, you know, I get served ads all the time because I'm on Facebook and I'm, and I'm like, you know, searching for fence companies or, or roofers or, con you know, hardscapers or concrete companies or what have you. So I get served ads. Um, and so what I'm proposing, and this is what I wanted to, to share with you as a, as a, something you could start implementing today, um, because I just reached out to 10 businesses this morning in 15 minutes flat on Facebook. It's the simplest way I've ever prospected. So this, and I've been teaching this and I have students that are actually closing business. I have one of my guys uh, in five days of doing this, he closed a client. And so not everyone's gonna do that. Some people have been at it for three, four weeks. They haven't closed a client yet. It's just a numbers game. You just can't control who or when, but you can control your attitude and you can control your actions. So the method is real simple. If they're running an ad and they're using like a, an image on their ad, um, what I do is I screenshot their ad, okay? And then I go into Facebook Messenger to their business page and I message them and I say, got your ad, dot, dot, dot. Here's a, here's a tip to, to help get more leads out of your ads. I'm not saying anything else. I'm getting straight to the point. F fluff is just not, it's, it, that's, that's the problem. You don't want to fluff it up. So, you know, got your ad, you know, here's a tip to get more leads out of your ads. Okay, send. And I send a, the screenshot of their ad. And then I do an audio, re a 30 to 60 second audio recording. Okay. Ed, what does it sound like? Well, I thought you'd never ask. It's super simple. Okay. Um, it goes like this. If you'd like to get more leads out of your ads, and I can say this because I do like 10, 20, 30 a day. So I've memorized it and I've, I've made it my own and you're going to have to make it your own as well. Um, if you'd like to get more leads out of your ads, do a video with you on camera, right? So the next fence job you're wrapping up, talk about the project, talk about your services, where you provide them, and show a lot of enthusiasm because people wanna do business with people they like and trust. And keep in mind, when someone's looking for a fence company, they're always gonna hit up Google, right? So make sure your website's doing a great job getting Google's attention, right? But it also covers your entire market really well. If you guys need more help generating business out of your website, you want to turn it into an asset, that's my specialty. Um, feel free to reach out. Right now, I'm offering a two-week free trial on my services to prove to you that I can help you get traction, get results. So feel free to reach out. So that's like 40, 45 seconds, okay? Um, you could do a 50% off through the end of the year. You can do two-week free trial, one-week free trial, 30-day free trial. Like... You can do whatever you want. And by the way, in case you guys are wondering, I'm at the bar. My daughter's going to, she's getting her horse uh, saddled up and she's going to be in here riding because she's doing a tournament uh, in November. So um, we're hanging out here for a little while this morning. Anyway, so that's the message. Can you do that? Of course you can. The question is, will you? Um, you can't do more than about 10 per hour on Facebook. Uh, no more than about 30 per day. So what I'm teaching my students people that are um, that are accountable to me, what I'm teaching them is do 10 in the morning, do 10 in the evening. If you wanna do an extra 10, do 30 a day, if you have the bandwidth to do it. 
It takes me about 15 minutes. It might take you 20, 25. You'll get them down, you know, over time. Um, so 40, 45 minutes of effort per day, right? If you did 20 per day, six days a week, I always recommend taking Sunday off. Um, that's 120 a week times four. That's 480, maybe almost 500 per month. Do you think out of 500 businesses, there's at least 10 that are open-minded and they want to grow business? Of course there are. Do you think out of the 10, one of them will say, I'm ready to go? And you onboard them, they do a, a week free trial, two weeks free trial, and then you then you then they start paying you? Of course. The problem is, will you stay consistent? Will you actually be the person that doesn't quit? If you stop and check results, if you stop, if you, well, this doesn't work, or uh, Ed doesn't know what he's talking about. Like, you, you have no clue what you're talking about. You're going to stay broke and you're not going to get the results you want because you're in your head and you're going to, you're trying to coach yourself to success. And if you knew how to be successful, you'd be successful. But if you're not, then hopefully you're listening. And I'm being a little strong for a reason because I'm just tired of people making excuses. You want to win? Then you need to do what I'm telling you. And you need to do 20 a day every day for the next three, four, five months. How hard is this work? It's not. It's just a matter of you doing the work and stop complaining about doing the work. And it's not working. You know what? It'll never work if you quit. What's your alternative? You gonna go back and get a job or whatever? Sorry, guys. I'm just being real. You know I'm right. So you, you can only control your attitude and your actions. I'm telling you this stuff because I know it works. I've onboarded new clients. I have students onboarding new clients. This stuff works for the people that work it. The question is, are you going to be consistent? And if you're not, good luck. You're not going to be, you're not going to get there. It's just going to be another thing that somebody teaches you that's going to be in, in one ear and out the other. So if you're sick and tired of being sick and tired, you better start listening. There's not going to be a simpler method of prospecting that you're ever going to find than this one. I could, I could sit on my bed and just with a cup of coffee and I could knock out messages and not even break a sweat. And then there are people, you know, digging trenches and putting in concrete patios and building decks and putting roofs on and all this kind of stuff. And they're busting their butts for their money and I'm sitting on the couch. And you can too, you just gotta work smart. And you gotta build your pipeline. And you gotta qualify these people to make sure you're working with the right people. So that is my message today. Um, use this approach. Um, sadly, most people won't use it. They'll, they'll think it's cute, they'll get motivated for a few days and then they'll quit. Please don't be that person. Be the individual that actually is serious and you actually want to get results and you're willing to keep going. It works, guys. It just flat works. In closing, right now I'm I'm working with three people one on one. They've inv they're investing they're they're investing to work with me one on one. I've never done this before. Uh, we just started this week. I'm going to see how it goes. Come early November, if I like the progress that we're having and stuff, uh, I may open it up to three more people in November by mid, maybe mid t the 10th, no, the 15th of November. So if you have any interest, if you feel like you might need personal one-on-one -on -one coaching, I'm not using a Facebook group. It's text, it's you, me on the phone. It's you and me texting every day and me helping you grow your business, adding new clients. Um, if that's something of interest to you, you could email me at info at edweidman.com or you could private message me on Facebook. If that, if you, if you're like open minded to that, we can have a chat about it and I can give you the details. Uh, should I decide to pull the trigger and do it again in November? I'm pretty sure I will, but we'll just have to play out the next couple of weeks. So I'm here to serve and help those who need it, who are actually going to go out there and apply it. If one on one personal coaching is, uh, something you feel you need, reach out seriously. Um, I want to help the right people who are willing to help themselves. Have yourselves a great weekend. God bless.